planting some zucchini blackjack. Zucchini blackjack is the most fine zucchini in the world. It is a very dark green color and when harvested regularly produces more fruit. Now, in this bag, the secret bag behind me, we have potatoes from the shop. We have left them in our pantry so it grows some shoots at the top like that. Like how? Now we can plant them and grow more potatoes. It's that easy. Now, let's hit the patch. Alright, now we're at the patch. We'll be planting our zucchini blackjack. Per usual, squish, 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 squish. Move around. Ew, on me. I don't like it. Take the tag. Ow. Here we have our zucchini blackjack with its roots everywhere, not everywhere like most of the plants I see. But <coughs> it doesn't smell nice. It's really... Mommy, um, Dad, you said there was three. There's four. Okay, we'll put two. By the looks two, of it. Put two in each hole. Okay. <laughs> That's a bit silly. The fairy dust makes it special, Dad. All right. Whatever makes water, you feel better. Water, 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 fairy dust and the leaves away. Slash dirt, not actual fairy dust. Okay. Don't splash dirt on your head. Now, get the zucchini blackjack tag. Put it here. Let you stay. Stay. Here, you can have some water too. <laughs> Alright, where are we off to now? Alright, now we're going to be off to the potato patch. Let's go. Now that we're at the potato patch, let's plant these potatoes that we've left in the pantry to get these really spiky looking roots. But they don't hurt, they just look spiky. They're quite um, ugly looking. I like them. Don't leave them, leave them alone. Rude. <laughs> Rude. Um, I think you put the roots facing down, I believe. Yeah. Yes. So I, I was going to say up, but then I remember the roots. Oh, they can be a down. bit, they can be a bit sideways. Yeah, but I prefer it to be a little bit Yeah, just put them sideways and then no, chuck I, them in. I put it kind of sideways. Okay. Right, that one's right there. Yeah. Ow. Mm -hmm. Mr. Krabs yeah. from Spongebob. If you haven't seen Spongebob, Spongebob, Spongebob then that's, that's just crazy. That's it. All right. So Let's chuck him in the hole too. Okay. Okay, and then we have yeah. this one as well. Side, put you on the side. Yeah, so just left in the pantry in the dark in the bag. They've grown these uh, little shoots. We might have used a couple because the bag is open. I never really opened Yeah, obviously those. we used a few. This one was Some a space. Do you want to pop these plants out and have a look what's yes, out there? Yes, yes, I'm excited. Oh, I'm right. excited. I'm really excited. Like, I was so excited when we popped out the other ones. <sighs> we already got one. Look at that. Fresh fine, baby. We have a couple over here that we found when we were just cleaning this up. We found these by just cleaning and Dad put... Like <laughs> the spike fruit. Yes, yes, Dad. You, you ruined one of my potatoes. All right. Well, That's let's so pull up so and see what we get. One of the stalks out. Okay. Nothing. All right. So right, we'll throw that away and then we'll Usually pull out the other one. Potatoes here. Whoa, the whole. There'll be like potatoes here. It smells like potato. Of course. Well, it is a potato plant it's after all. Now let's pick up this. Hopefully, there's no worms in it. Or oh, worm poop. Worms are actually really good for your plants because they do help water them. Like they poop, makes some like water. I'm going to keep digging while I speak. Um, but their poop like helps. I don't know why, but it just does something. Maybe it gives them nutrients. That's right. I'm pretty sure, yes. For, I've done my research. Yeah. I hope you like my filming skills, by the way, guys. E I think you already picked a lot out of this one, Chrissy. I know. I, I, I like picking potatoes. I just love the aspects of it. You can't have this off, huh? Yes, I cannot. Be careful of the worms! That's all right. That's why I use the pitchfork. It doesn't, it doesn't hurt them. Oh, really? Oh, I never I knew that. There's nothing left here. Really? So I, t I took them all, are you sure? Yeah, I think you took them all before. Okay. So, I'll just fix that up. Alright. 
there's the red side over there. It's really overgrown, as you can see there. Look at all that. I'll chuck these couple in there as well, over here. Okay. Yeah, you do that. You're better at this. You're a professional planter, Dad. Oh, not too bad. You're all right. You're all right. You're not better than me, obviously, even though you taught me everything I know. <laughs> like in the right. Jedi movies, how like the master teaches the, the 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 apprentice more than he the person actually knows. So then they destroy them if they turn evil. Is that right? Yes. Unless they don't turn evil. Okay, so that's all like Dark Vader. They're all done. Yeah. So we'll water them in shortly. Okay. Can we head on to the red side later? Yeah, if you want, I'll film you. Yay! You can pull a couple of those ones out. Alright, let's head okay. there now. Alright, now we're on to the red side. We're only going to pick one. Like, we're only going to rip one. Which I'm devastated, but my dad told me to, so... Woo! Whoa! Look how red these are! Yeah. That's a big red one. That's like... Very nice. Then we have a smallish one that we can also use as a seed. That yeah. is also a beautiful bread. That's a good idea. We'll turn some into seeds again. I'm going to take this again. one because it's also kind of small that I can use as a seed. Okay.